Also breaking overnight, Orlando police are working right now to figure out who shot two people. The scene is playing out in the last few hours along King Cole Boulevard, right near Willie Mays Park. News 6 reporter Mark Lehman is live working to get us some answers from Orlando police. So, Mark, how are those victims doing at this point? David, within the last couple hours, we got word that both of those victims are expected to be okay. Good news on that front, but there are still a lot of questions that remain unanswered this morning about what led up to the shooting that happened here at this home late last night. Now, we were here on scene as crime scene technicians began collecting evidence, and you can see the large response uh, from Orlando police as well. Investigators say a 911 call came in about the shooting around 11 last night. When officers arrived, they found two victims with gunshot wounds. Their injuries were non life threatening, but that's all the information that's being released at this time. Police are not revealing what led up to the shooting. They're also not saying anything about a possible suspect, and that's something we're working to get answers to right now. While uh, investigators have cleared the scene out here, uh, back out here live, we're asking police if they're still searching for a gunman or if they have any idea who opened. And fire in the shooting last night. Of course, once we get that information, we'll make sure to pass along to you right here on News 6. David and Bridget. Mark, thank you.